Hey everybody, this is Brett, and today I'm going to show you this brand new 2022 Ram 2500 Mega Cab Short Box Bighorn Level C Night Edition. I'm here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Ram and heavy duty truck headquarters. This 2022 Ram 2500 has the 6.7 liter Cummins diesel engine, puts out 370 horsepower and 850 foot-pounds of torque. Um, it's paired up with the 68 RFE automatic transmission. And I'm just gonna go all the way around in this video. Uh, important to note that this truck can tow up to 14,480 pounds and it has a max payload of 1,920 pounds. So I got those right off of Ram's tow guide website. I'll link that in the description below. So definitely check that out if you got a Ram and want to find out how much it can tow. It's a really neat website. You just put the VIN in, you're all set to go. Anyways, um, Granite Crystal is the color on this truck. We're just going to go all the way around it, check out the original window sticker. I'll show you the features inside of the truck as well as uh, what the particulars on this truck. So you'll notice the blacked out grill, the blacked out headlight bezels, all part of the night edition, as well as the painted front bumpers. This one does have the front park parking sensors, factory fog lights. Uh, notice the blacked out 2500 and Cummins and Ram logo, logo right there, all part of that night edition, as well as the 20 inch painted alloy rims. And those 20 inch rims then give you the Firestone Transforce AT tires. These are LT28560 R20s and they are definitely an all-terrain tread pattern. So you get the shock and the spring in the front here. Uh, granite crystal, it's got a lot of metal flake to it. It's one of my favorite colors on the Rams. This one does have the tow mirrors. We'll take a look at that original window sticker. Feel free to pause this. I'm not gonna go through everything, but um, most of it. 2022 Ram 2500, Bighorn Mega Cab, 6.7 liter Cummins diesel, six speed um, 68 RFE automatic transmission. This one does have 373 gears right there. Everything on your left is your standard equipment. Exterior features, all standard there as well. Granite crystals, 200 bucks. Premium cloth bucket seats are 295. The night edition is 3,095 bucks. Gives you the front and rear painted bumpers, the 20 inch rims, the park sense front and rear park assist system, and the black interior accents. This one has the level C equipment group, which is a $4,640 option. What does that give you? It gives you the 115 volt um, outlet, 100 or uh, heated seats, rear power sliding rear window, um, AC with dual zone and temp control, eight way power adjustable driver seat, front fog lights, heated steering wheel, steering wheel with mounted audio controls, um, park sense front and rear park assist system. So that's kind of redundant to the uh, night edition, a remote start and a 400 watt inverter. 220 amp alternator is 145 and the Cummins diesel is a 95, $95 option. Uconnect five with nav is 795. And your total MSRP is 76,330 bucks. And if you want to get your summit price, you can go to our website, which is linked in the upper right hand part of the screen. Three year 36 bumper to bumper. And because of that Cummins diesel, you get a five year 100,000 powertrain warranty. Uh, greenhouse gas and smog ratings are actually really good. They're uh, both at B's and uh, not really rated for the uh, crash test ratings yet. Uh, rollover is three stars. Otherwise, they're not rated. So that's the whole window sticker, definitely. Um, you can check that out, pause it, print it, whatever. Mega Cab's got just a ton of room in the back. And uh, one thing people always ask me to do is put both sides down. So I will put, I will do that right now. So you can put these seats all the way down and they go nice and flat. So I'll put the other side down in just a second here and show you what it looks like with that. Uh, the 2500s have rear springs in the back, which gives you a lot smoother ride when you're unloaded. You also have LED lights in the back here. Painted rear bumper, full towing package. Uh, once again, remember that this one can tow up to 14,480 pounds and has a payload of 1,920 pounds. 
do get that 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in back here, side box tie downs, and uh, yeah. Notice you get the blacked out RAM and 4x4 logo as well, as well as the Bighorn logo there. Has those heated mirrors, they fold up, they have built-in directional signals, they also fold in like so. And uh, let's check out those back seats going all the way down. So I will show you that you can put just the backrest down. You can see what a difference that that is when just the backrest is down. It's a lot lower uh, when you put the whole thing down. But that goes with this handle right here. And you can see just how nice and flat that is. So if you got pets, put both sides down. They get a huge place to lay it, or if you even yourself want to take a nap back here. It's nice and flat. You put a couple blankets down, you're all set to go. Uh, you get the power slide and rear window with the built-in rear defrost, and you do get storage back here. You also get your latched tether anchors, two USBs, two USB-Cs, 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in back here, and side curtain airbags on this truck. Seats go up like so, and you get child safety locks on the back doors. Uh, inside, you get power windows, power locks, power mirrors, cloth bolsters, wood grain trim, auto headlamps, power pedals, and the uh, dark charcoal and black cloth interior, like the design on there. Um, kind of the titanium stitching, power driver seat with lumbar, and uh, factory floor mat right there. Nice leather wrap steering wheel. Uh, remember this is heated with that level C group, Bluetooth and information center controls, cruise controls, gear selector, the six speed 68 RFE automatic transmission. I will turn the ignition on here and we'll check out the uh, radio. So this is the Uconnect 5 radio. Um, looks just a little bit different than the Uconnect 4. Um, the buttons are a little cleaner, I think, and the nav systems like a couple different colors and stuff. So that's pretty cool. You have your AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. Um, obviously you can do two USBs, two USB-Cs, and AUX jack down there as well. Um, you have your vehicle with all your different apps and stuff, which, there we go, not all. You got your backup camera, which they've made these backup cameras HD, really like that. Um, and when the truck's on, you can actually zoom in on it. So that's pretty cool too. And then you have all your, your different apps here. You notice how fast everything goes. This radio is supposed to be five times faster than the uh, old Uconnect 4 system. So there's your, you can see just how fast those pulled up. There's your off-road pages. You got your steering angle. As I turn the steering wheel, that changes whether you're in two high or four high or four low. You have your different accessory gauges and your pitch and roll, as well as latitude, longitude, and your altitude. So a lot of cool stuff you can do with this radio. Just kind of scroll through some of these. Feel free to pause, see everything it has, um, and all that good stuff. You can get weather and everything on there. So a lot of cool stuff. You can do your more tactile climate controls, factory brake controller. Uh, this one has factory exhaust brake, tow haul, and front and rear parking sensors there. Uh, this one does come with the remote start, and you do get another 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in, cell phone holder, two cup holders, coin holders here, storage tray, and you get the Bighorn logo on the dash there. Up here it does have assist and SOS buttons, power slide and rear window button, map lights, and home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems, auto, rear view mirror, and uh, auto dim, rear view mirror, and then the wood grain trim on the dash. 7-inch LCD display, and I'm just going to start it up in just a second here. I do want to show you the uh, tire and loading information, even though I gave you all the tow ratings and stuff. A lot of people like seeing this so that they can see for themselves, um, gross vehicle weight rating, and whatnot on there. PAU is the paint code. You always find that right there. And I do want to start it up just because these are so quiet for being a, you know, Cummins diesel engine. Let's 
super quiet. LED tail lamps, love those. The LED license plate lights, like those a lot too. And by the time it gets back here, Here, just how quiet that is. Almost like nothing. Take a quick look under the hood too. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you've gotten a really good idea of the overall look, styling, options on this truck. There is your emissions sticker. And uh, Thank you so much for checking out the video. If you liked the video, give us a like, subscribe, and share on our YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash Summit Auto. And uh, if you want to see more pictures of this truck or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, you name it, we got to go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. If you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash Summit Auto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. Click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. In fact, any second, you'll see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left. A link to more Ram 2500 truck videos like this one in the upper right. A link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out, and we're super excited to be helping you with this brand new 2022 Ram 2500 Mega Cab Short Box Bighorn Level C. Night Edition and Granite Crystal Metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on my YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.